All right, this is what I was thinking about, right? Where we, it gives us a slope and a point. But this one for sure is not the y-intercept just because the x value is a negative 2, okay? So I know this is not my y-intercept, so I'm going to have to use my point-slope formula. And we can see the slope up there is negative 2, so we'll distribute that. We've got the x and y values. Where x is negative 2 and the y value is 5. And yeah, it, this is important for us to see as well. That's minus a negative there, so I'm going to change that to a plus. And let's go ahead and distribute the negative 2 now. So negative 2 times x is negative 2x, and negative 2 groups of 2 is negative 4. So y equals negative 2x minus 4 plus 5. Uh, and just after simplifying this, we'll see the slope-intercept form there. y equals negative 2x. Negative 4 plus 5 is positive 1. And there's our slope in green, and the y-intercept would be 0, 1 on that.